Hello, hello, day two. All right, how was it yesterday? Did you complain a little bit about the challenge? <laughs> I hope that you find day one empowering and challenging because if you're not challenging yourself, you're not growing. Okay, so this is what it's all about. And as I told you before, all of these things are simple. They're not easy, but they're simple. So are you ready for day two? Today, we are going to talk about limiting beliefs, okay? You are going, to, your challenge today is to identify one limiting belief that you are holding on to right now. Yes. So uh, here's my basic story. My limiting belief was that I was not able to do this challenge, you know, for months and months and months, I keep postponing um, creating videos and going live on my platforms because I thought that um, I didn't have the time. I um, wasn't ready with the makeup every time I was like, oh, I, I should make a video about this. But I'm like, oh, no, I'm, I'm just wearing a T-shirt and I don't have makeup on. Um, the hair, the hair was a big deal. <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, uh, yeah, no, I'm not showing up on camera with this hair. And, um, you know, other things like technical issues, like, well, I, I don't have the light on and it's super bright and like, oh, the dog is barking, um, you name it. I will make a bunch of excuses just not to show up until a friend told me, are you making excuses or are those reasons for not doing what you want to do? And I was like, oh, wait a minute, what? Yes. Because we tend to make excuses that we call reasons not to do what we want to do. You get it? And so what happened there to um, get rid of that limiting belief? I was like in a lot of prayer and I was like, God, all the glory to you. Whatever I'm going to do, I'm going to do it to help others to share that I love you. And here I am right? And about the hair, I'm still a little worried about it, but um, my solution for that is grab a hat. <laughs> so that's pretty much my basic story. And this is the challenge for you. Today, I want you to think throughout the day of one limiting belief that you are holding on to, okay? And I want you to ask yourself a couple of questions. Okay, here's three questions for you to ask. And I'm going to put them in the comments so you can um, look at them throughout the day. Uh, but just kind of start thinking about it, okay? So the first one, which one is it? Which one is it? Something that is really heavy in your life that you are thinking about doing, but you're just like, mm, no, I cannot do this because they're this or that. And don't worry so much about the answers right now, but just like, why are you not doing it? But find that one thing that is, that is waiting on you. Okay. So that's number one. The second question is, where did this belief originated from? Is it based on past experiences and social norms or assumptions? Okay. Because our environment will tell us also um, limited, <laughs> limiting our, our movement and setting goals and things like that. So just try to identify one limiting belief, where it's coming from. And the last one is how does this belief impact your thoughts, your emotions, and your actions? Like when I was not doing, or I was like, oh, I can't do this video thing anymore. I, um, I will say like, okay, I can't do it. 
but I will be thinking about it all day, all the time. And I will feel like sad and seeing all my friends and peers on my mastermind group doing great things. And I'll be like, oh, I'm not doing it, you know, and um, just the actions, because I used to say, oh, I'm a podcaster and a YouTuber. And wait a minute, I haven't posted a video in months. So there you go. I'm going over my five minutes. So that's the challenge for you today. Let me know in the comments how these questions are impacting your day and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.